today I would like to talk about the myths and the facts of Abiri, known as Ontario on the latter. Abiri looks so much like avocado, but it is not. When open, the seeds are used and taste very, very bitter. And because of the bitter taste, it is erroneously believed that it kills diabetes. Abiri is said to be good for people with diseases such as stomach ulcer or pains, for people with high blood pressure problems, for people suffering from diabetes, and for many other incurable diseases. Many people have been deceived into buying medications made from combinations of abiri and other herbs in their quest to finding cure for this deadly disease called diabetes and in the process have damaged some of their vital organs. The notion that abiri cures diabetes from my personal experience is a myth. Abiri is not a magic fruit that cures or reverses diabetes. You need to know the facts. After diabetes diagnosis, Abiri will bring down a very high blood sugar level immediately. But within an hour or two, the sugar level rises up again and you are back to square one people just continue to consume large amounts of these seeds without thinking of the side effects. Some eat junk food and drink sugary beverages and then take abiri, thereby inviting more ailments into their bodies. Abiri can be prepared in many ways, but from my experience, I would recommend this method the abiri. Bring out the seeds, blend in a blender, add a little water and blend until it is smooth. Take half teaspoon, put in a glass cup of coconut milk, add water, and you can drink. This is very gentle on the stomach. Abiri is not a magic fruit and on its own cannot reverse diabetes. In my next video, by the grace of God, I will tell you how and when to use Abiri with lifestyle changes while on your way to permanently reverse your diabetes diabetes is reversible only through lifestyle changes and you can do it please subscribe for more tips god bless you